Yo, 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 you're watching Day Day's Gameplay, and I'm your host, Day Day, and today we're going to be breaking down a nice little clip we got, telling you what not to do, instead of exactly kind of what to do, because this team screws it all up. Let's get it started. Running forward, these guys know exactly where I'm at. I was coming from airport, they were already engaging me. This is not my bounty. Um, it ends up being someone else, they saw me engaging another team. Uh, they knew which way I was taking because they already got shots on me. So, easy predict. I got the gas coming in directly behind me. These guys, again, know where I'm at. First guy jumps around the corner with a sniper rifle. I couldn't believe it myself. We zoom in. We can see that it's a sniper rifle where he switched to a sniper rifle. I see him. He immediately starts to shoot at where I'm at. He misses every shot because it's only one due to a sniper rifle. That's going to cost him. I go ahead and jump over, changing the elevation at which that I'm at to get me a quick, easy down. Notice the other guy coming around the corner, right? He ends up being in the middle of transitioning into another weapon. Uh, he, he's got his primary on the back, which is a sniper rifle, and it looks as if he's switching to his secondary. You already know that you're about to engage a teammate. Don't have a sniper rifle out if it's up close and personal. And this is exactly what this is, up close and personal. This guy, his team, uh, the first guy that I'm engaging is trying to jump out of the way, but it's already too late. That day's already locked on, just like you guys. You get locked on, you take the kill. You take him down. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. As I'm downing him, notice what I'm going to do. I'm going to push forward, right? I throw myself forward so I get the little sprint animation. I slide and immediately turn around as I'm sliding and jump backwards. Let's, let's rewatch that. All right, maybe you didn't catch it the first time. So we're going to run up through here, get first shots on him, bunny hopping. Go ahead and forward slide, slide cancel, turning as I'm slide canceling. See, this guy is in the middle of a tactical sprint. I don't know why he was already... Why are you running? Why are you running? Ready engaging me. As you can see, I've already got a plate and a half left. Could have probably finished me off, so don't be doing that. If you're already engaging someone, stay with him. There was no reason for him to try and slide cancel. I'm not even looking at him while he's shooting at me. Should have went ahead and finished a kill. I need to slide cancel to break his camera to get out of his line of sight. I immediately turn around. I jump and get shots on target. I'm aiming at his legs, but what I got to do is fix my centering to bring it up. He jumps as I jump. He's got me cracked. I jump again as he's coming down, right? So it just happens to be random timing. Again, going over what you shouldn't do, don't have your sniper rifle out trying to get uh, these, these quick kills. I mean, yeah, you can if you're trying to go for a clip, but if you're trying to get better, make sure you're using the right gun in the right situation. And for up close and personal, by, by a long shot, it's usually going to be your secondaries, which are your submachine guns. And those pesky little shotguns. It's help out a lot. Also, check out either the video I just uploaded yesterday or the shorts playlist. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace and love.